It is a historical fact that pensioners in this country are amongst the poorest in the Western world. We and the Pensioners Party will change all of that. First of all, we will roll back the official retirement age to 65 for men and for women. However, if you wish and choose and are able, you can work past the official retirement age. That won't change, but the official retirement age will be rolled back to 65. Now also, pensions need to be reclassified from earned income to already earned income to stop the outrageous practice of paying tax twice once when you pay in to a pension plan whether it is a state driven pension plan or a private one that money is already taxed and when you get it back in the form of a pension it is then taxed once more that has to stop we will also make state retirement pensions entirely free of taxation in perpetuity by the way state retirement pensions must be and shall be permanently linked to half the national average UK salary as calculated by the Office of Government Statistics. We intend for all retirement pensioners to receive domestic gas supplies free of all charges and fees during a designated period. The designated period shall run from the 1st of October continuously through to the 31st of March of the following year. However, to stop abuses, an upper limit shall be applied to all those receiving the state allowance, and that upper limit will be based on a national average consumption during the winter months. Now, it will also be free of charge at the point of use. Also, state retirement pensioners will receive electricity supplies, again free of all charges and all fees during the same designated period. That is to say, from the 1st of October continuously through to the 31st of March the following year. And again, to avoid anyone abusing this, there will be an upper limit set. And again, this upper limit will be based on a national average of winter consumption of electricity. Now, unless you know about it, this may come as something of a shock. By the year 2025, it is the intention to cease all landline telephone services in this country. However, we in the Pensioners Party are opposed to this intention and we shall vigorously fight against it. Our intention is to supply a free BT landline service throughout the UK for all those receiving a state retirement pension. However, 
international telephone calls will still be chargeable. We think that's only fair because they cost so much more. And again, there will be an upper limit set on the internal, that is to say, telephone calls within the UK. An upper limit will be set, again, based on an average telephone bill by pensioners. So there is much to consider. There is much that is good in this intention. Things that we say and demand of the present government and any future government until we are the government. It is also our intention, wherever possible, to make pensioners much more inclusive in local affairs and national affairs. And we think it is only fair that any pensioner or any person over their official retirement age, which would be 65, who continues to work in whatever field must be paid the same as those younger colleagues. There should be no attempt at paying less because a person is over 65. Now, these are broad outlines and broad outlines only. But if you like what you hear and agree with what I've said, then please join us. And if you can't feel yourself able to join the party, but can, in some small way, give a donation, then that donation will be gratefully accepted and put to good use, I assure you. So until the next broadcast, I am John Davidson, leader of the Pensioners Party, wishing you goodbye and God bless.